la la. Because you I don't know what to wear. I don't know what to Hey, hey Sarah. Um, so, Chooks asked me out on a date. I need your help. Yeah, what's up? Talk, talk to me. Chooks asked me out on a date, and I'm suspecting he might pop the question. You know what I mean? He might propose. So, I need you to help me pick the most appropriate outfit. What's funny? Was that a joke? What part of what I said sounded like a joke? The part you said he must propose. I really think he's going to propose to me. <laughs> Stop that. Stop screaming nonsense out of your mouth. So you think a guy you met just five months ago will propose to you? Eh? This is where you're getting it all wrong. It's not about how far, but how well. Chooks and I are in love, and it feels so right. Oh, oh. <laughs> that guy is my soulmate. You know what? I'm not gonna do this with you. Okay, I don't expect you to understand because you don't know what love is. Okay, so the reason I called you, the only reason I called you is for you to help me choose an outfit. At least you're good at it. You're good at it. Okay, this is Lover Lover. Let me see what you have. Oh, boy, oh boy. All right. Staring at me since we got here. Mm -hmm. And that is because I cannot get enough of you. I feel nervous each time you stare at me in that way. And I also get butterflies. <laughs> you know, you are the most. Beautiful woman I've ever set my eyes on. And I feel so lucky to have you in my life. Yes. You and what? My favorite detective. Oh. The only one who has stolen my heart. You have a way with words. Mm -hmm. yeah, you can. <laughs> well, um, you can say that again. Look, because if my heart 
has to be locked up to have you in my life. Then it better be locked up forever. Oh, please. <laughs> Look, Laura, can I have your hand? I need to ask you a very important question. Look, I know this question is coming too early. But when I see what is meant to be, I know it. Lara, you and I are meant to be together. Yes, I can feel it. I cannot wait to start forever with you. Look. Lara Jalade. Please. Will you marry me? really spent quality time together. So I am thinking if I can move in with you, I mean, for a while, mm -hmm. let's have some fun time together. Yes, why not? Right. <laughs> Give me a minute. Okay. I need to call my mom to tell her that I'm engaged. Oh, yes, you are off the market. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you know, I thought you were crazy when you said he was going to propose. Now you see, I'm not crazy. Oh my God. <laughs> but why would you accept a proposal from someone you barely know? You even let him move in with you. How do you mean someone I barely know? We've been together for five months. Oh my God, your ring is so beautiful. Thank you. Congrats. Hi, Chooks. Congrats. Thank you. Fine, babe. Babe, um, so I'll be out for a while, okay? Okay. I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> I'll see you. Okay, see you soon. Okay. <laughs> you see how good looking he looks? So aside his good looks, what else do you know about him? A lot. Mm. Mm. So where is he from? He's an Igbo guy. Where in Igbo land? I don't know. I just know that he's an Igbo guy. <laughs> but what does he do for a living? Um, he's into business. What kind of business? <laughs> business is business. Does it matter? You know Igbo men, they like to do business. To think that someone will expect better from a police officer like you.
baby. <laughs> baby, wake up, wake up. Shano me, Joe. Joe, Jesus, perform your miracle. Ah, ah, ah. Look at my baby's blood. Ah, who did this to me? Who did this to me? Baby, wake up, baby. Baby, wake up, wake up, wake up. Ah. Who did this to me? Who did this to me? Who did this to me? Baby, wake up. Baby, wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Who did this to me? Woo, woo, woo. My love, my love. Look at, look at our baby. Oh, get up, get up. You promised me. Look at, baby is still breathing. Baby, 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 you cannot leave us this way. Ah. <laughs> ah, look at what they did to my husband. Look at what they did to my husband. Look at, look at my husband. Look at my husband. You are stabbed. <laughs> look at what they did to my husband. Look at what they did to my husband just to go to the market and come back. Wake up, Jesus. Perform your miracle. Perform your miracle. You can't, Jesus. Madam. You can't. Madam. You can't. Madam, you need to calm down. Madam, you need to calm down. I cannot calm down. I cannot calm down. I cannot calm down. I cannot calm down. They've killed the love of my life and you are telling me to calm down. Eh? If you were the one, will you calm down? They killed him in his own house. They stabbed my baby. Yeah. That me low Joe. Shanu me. Shanu me. Shanu me. Shanu me, Joe. Today. Baby, wake up. Wake up, baby. Baby. <laughs> baby. Ah! They did this to you. You do not deserve this. My husband does not deserve this. Hey. Baby, baby, wake up now, please. Tell me this is a prank, George. Shanu me. Shanu me. Ah. Call the ambulance. He's not breathing. Ambulance. Ah, baby, are you gone just like that? Baby, get up. Baby, get up. They want to call ambulance for you, DJ. Shanu me. Baby, baby, they want to call ambulance. So I'll pay the ambulance. My baby, they want to call the ambulance. Oh. <laughs> My husband is an easygoing person. He doesn't look for trouble. <laughs> He's a peacemaker. He does not deserve to die like this. <laughs> what was your husband saying? <laughs> for his mother. times 
Pamela mah diri jauh mimpi Diri saya ini pintuni Pasti juga sebelah itu apa buat Where was I walking? <laughs> he, he worked as an accountant for, for an investment company. Okay. got laid off from work. He opened up to me. He opened up to me. <laughs> and told me how his friend got into his computer and had taken vital details. This same friend into the company's back account where my husband worked and and and, and it wiped everything in the account <laughs> it wiped everything <laughs> my husband was held responsible for it he was sad he was sad, and they gave him an ultimatum to to pay back the money. <laughs> he knew his friend was responsible for this action. He peacefully confronted him. Told him to return the money. He knew he was responsible for the action because this friend of his is a well known hacker and an online fraud star. <laughs> <laughs> Ten percent of the money, so that we could we could leave the country. started threatening my husband. He had no choice other than to threaten his friend. He threatened to report him to the police. <laughs> Look at me, 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 look at me
talking about what does it look like it's dark he has he has a tattoo on his left arm <laughs> He has piercings and he is muscular. Hey, babe. Ah, you're back. Come here. Oh. How are you? I'm fine. How was work? Uh, work was great, I guess. Babe, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, you look stressed out. Mm -hmm. Detective work. So <laughs> did you win any case today? No, no new case. Uh, well, anyway, um, I'm in the kitchen making dinner. So why don't you go upstairs and freshen up and while I set the table? Hmm? My detective. Mm -hmm. I catch you. Mm -hmm. Ha! I catch you. <laughs> Chukwe Mecca Collins.
burn material, right? Busy, busy. Mm. You left home so early. Where did you go? Well, I went to sort out business. What business is that? In fact, I want to know everything about the business that you do. Babe. Why do you suddenly want to know about my business? Hmm? Is there anything wrong with me knowing about the business that my parents are doing? Um, oh, no. no. Not at all. I should know, right? Yeah. So? Um. Well. I am into buying and selling. What do you buy and what do you sell? Is there a reason for these questions? Is there a reason you should have problem with these questions? I mean, you are my husband-to-be. Yes. And we're trying to get to know ourselves, right? Oh, yes. So, what's the point of us living together? to get to know ourselves, right? Right, right. Well, um, I am into buying and selling of cars. Yeah, I deal on automobiles. Oh. Mm, you know, I was gonna tell you. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Thank you, detective. Uh, is the interrogations over? So we can at least eat our food. Detective, talk to me. Has he been found? Have you found the person that murdered my husband? Has he been found? Tell me. Tell me you found him, please. Please tell me you found him. Not yet. What? I made some findings online. Some research and I was able to get some information. Oh my God. So, is there, is there any hope at all that we are going to find him. Is there any hope? I need to know because this man has scammed a lot of people. He has killed others as well. And if we do not act fast, if you don't act fast, he's going to kill a lot more. Look, I heard, I heard he killed a lady he was engaged to. Yes, he killed her. He killed her because she was threatening to report him to EFCC. Chooks kills anyone that stands in his way. That's what he does. He kills anyone that stands in his way. Detective, you have to act fast. You need to. Yes, I do. My husband keeps records of all of the threat calls and chat. You have his phone in Pasco? Yes. In that place? Yes. Detective. Every, every of the threats, the calls, the messages, 
every of the threats is in that form. Look, on the day my husband was murdered, he had called me to inform me that Chooks was coming over to our house. So if you check that phone, you would find a record of their conversation on that phone. He told me Chooks was coming over so they could talk about the pending issues they had. So if you check that phone, I'm sure there's a record of their conversation on that phone. Detective, Chooks is a murderer. He is a murderer. You need to act fast. You need to act fast. We are talking about a dangerous human. Chooks is very dangerous. He is dangerous. You need to act fast before he kills many, many people. You're a detective, you should know the right thing to do. Are you suggesting that I hand over my fiancé to the law? <laughs> Your fiancé is a criminal, a bloody one at that. You're housing a criminal and you must get implicated. Come on, I shouldn't be telling you these things. I'm in love with this guy. <sighs> Lara, are you mad? Are you crazy? You are talking about a mother case and you are talking about love. Are you not scared for yourself? Do you know what this guy would do to you if he has the slightest idea you are on his case? Do you think he will hurt me? No. He will sacrifice himself for you to get some credit. I'm sure you are the love of his life. A pregnant woman just lost her husband. We don't know who the next victim is. It could be you. So what is it going to be? Love over justice or justice over love? You're going to be here for a while. Uh, yeah, I, I thought so too, but something came up. And then I've missed home. Huh? So, Mia yeah, isn't home. Uh, look, babe, you're my home. Mm? And I can't wait for us to be married and do this properly. Huh? Okay, Baba, what is there now? I think we should just stay apart for now. Oh, God, I'm glad you do. Hmm? Look, I love you. I love you so much. Hmm? Come here. Mm -mm. Mm. So, 
So, um, I'll see you around, okay? in the house. Lara? Lara? Officer Ray and I have the right to arrest you, Mr. Chukomeka Collins, for the murder of one George Mado. You have the right to remain silent for what? So, if I do say here, we we'll use against you the court of law. Arrest this criminal, Officer Ray. Look, I didn't Look, do it. it. Chooks! I didn't do it. Game over. Now you move! 